Hello friends, let's install git extensions tool on our local system. So git extensions is an open source tool which utilizes the features of git and enables the user to use the git features using a graphical user interface. For installing git extensions, we go to the git extensions.github.io, this, this URL. So let's go to the browser, open this URL and say download. When we go to the download, this is the latest version here, 331. And for Windows, uh, we have MSI file, we need to download it. If we don't want to download it, we can also uh, download a zip version uh, or a portable version even and use it. But uh, for this tutorial, we will use MSI. So I have downloaded is previously and this is the MSI file that I will use to install on my local system. On starting, it will uh, show you the information. Let's click next and then use install for all users options and then provide the path where to install. Click next. I will go with the default options. It works good for me. Here we need to choose between open SSH and PuTTY. So if you remember in my previous video when we were installing Git, we were using uh, open SSH option while installation. So here also we need to use open SSH. Here it is asking for telemetry. Telemetry is nothing but uh, uh, Git extension is trying to ask you whether it can send some data for their uh, uh, intelligence and uh, rectifying the probable bugs. Those are there in the system. I'm not a fan of this, so I unclicked it and click next. And here is the final step, say install. It will ask for permission. You need to say yes. And it will install Git extensions on your local system. So installation is finished. We say finish. And let's check if it is installed. So here we see it, Git extensions tool. We start it. And here we see. So we will uh, get into each and every control of it in later sessions. But here is what we need to do first. Here is settings. So we need to check that this first line is green. Git is found on your computer. It is found because we have installed it uh, in a previous uh, video, if you have missed it, uh, please go through the video first and install Git on your local system and then come to this video if you are following it. And there are various red items with which we will resolve in next videos. And these red items needs to be resolved in order to utilize the features provided by this GUI tool. So, happy getting. If you like the video, please subscribe and like it. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.